Hi guys, this is Dr. Kramer with Upper Cervical Chiropractic Los Angeles. I'm here with Raina. Now Raina started here about a month ago. Uh, she came in with an assortment of issues. Raina, I guess let's start off with uh, allergies. You had allergies before you came here. Uh, how are they doing now? Oh, that's much better, very much better. And uh, what, what, what did you notice when you had allergies? What would happen to you? I can hardly breathe. I can, I, my eyes was um, itchy, and I, uh, I can hardly breathe. And you were taking medication uh, almost every day for that, every right? Every day, every day, uh, one or two pills every day. And now you're not taking as much because you're not feeling <laughs> allergies. I forget to tell, take it because I don't need it. <laughs> there you go. Now another issue you had was uh, some stomach acid and indigestion and stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, you've had that for five years where you've been taking the uh, Omeprazil Prilosec every day. Uh -huh. uh, how, how are you doing with your stomach stuff now? I do much better, much better. Now, uh, describe to me the, I guess on a scale of 1 to 10, if 10 is the worst and 1 is you're doing great, what was your stomach stuff before? I think you mentioned it was a 10 before. That, that's what it was. And now it's about a 2 or 3. Uh-huh. So it's gotten that's right. a lot better. That's right. And do you feel a need to take the stomach pills every day or not, 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 no. not really anymore? No, not really. No. Okay, uh, and last but not least, you, you had headaches, right? Very much. I, I think you, for the last year, you've almost had them every single day. That's right. And uh, now, uh, now are, you, are you getting the headaches every day, or? No, 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 I have bumps in my head. Yeah, you had bumps in your head, <laughs> yes. you really had bumps in your head. Yes. How are those doing? No more. The no bumps more. have gone away. Now you've gone to the hospital and stuff uh -huh. to get the stuff checked out. Probably two, three times I've been in hospital. For ha migraines, uh -huh. headaches. That's right. And uh, how often are you getting headaches now? Mm, I can hardly say, believe me. Well, I don't... A lot better, right? A lot better, I yeah. had I had here today, uh, when I took notes, you, if 10 is the worst, you were at a 10 before with the bumps and the headaches, and now you're about a 2. Does that that's, sound about right? Yeah, that's right, yeah. Okay, and last but not least, uh, you had neck pain, right? Before you came to this clinic? Oh, yes. I can feel my head like a weight tons in my shoulders. And uh, yeah. since you started here, that's improved a lot, correct? Yes, yes. I feel even, um, I don't know, more fresh. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, let's. Before you came here on a scale of 1 to 10, you gave it about a what? The next stuff. 10. And uh, now, what would you say your neck pain is these days? Probably 2. No, nothing. Almost nothing. Almost nothing. <laughs> almost a 2. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Raina. Hey, thanks for being a good sport and doing this interview. Yeah, uh, guys, no we're, we're, we want all her stuff to go away, but the fascinating thing to me is not just the headaches, but she had lumps on her head. How long did you have those lumps on your head for? Oh, probably for two years. Two years? You, yeah. you got checked it out by the doctor. Uh -huh. they, they don't know what's going on. You got no, your migraines no, no. and your headaches. And now all that's almost gone. That's right. All right, Raina. Thank you so much. You